All right, we're going to do a little video uh, with Max. Uh, his biggest issue is dog reactivity. So the best way to get rid of this is go get you a whole bunch of dogs and put the reactive one on a leash and have them walk calmly amongst a group of dogs. And if they start fixating or getting tense or acting up, you correct them. It's that simple. And it's not simple, it's time consuming, but that's the idea. So this is basically all I'm doing with Max. Off. Yeah. So whether it's, the Max is not neutered, so I have some female dogs in here too, and Zeke is not, also not neutered. So that's a, a few different triggers there, especially with un unneutered male dogs. And uh, Molly is also not spayed yet. They're planning on doing all this once they get the dogs back. But for now, everybody's got their parts pretty much, except for a couple of them. And, uh, and that's all it is right there. I don't even want him getting tense and getting up in a dog's face. If he does, it's just a quick little correction. That's it. There's no need to, to show a lot of emotion and get mad or anything like that. You just want to correct it before it escalates into excitement. You want to make a small correction right when you see the body language change. And I also want him, I don't want him just, just to not react, I also want him to walk with a, uh, a pretty loose lead right now too, I don't want him pulling. See that was really good because he wanted to he wanted to follow her and sniff her because he knows that she's she's not fixed. An unneutered dog can pick that up in a heartbeat, but he redirected and, and went about and minded his own business. So that's just a little demonstration on how I work with that. Uh, another term for it is called flooding, which basically means whatever their issue is, you just overexpose them to that issue until they get over it and learn how to behave. So, uh, and you know, for somebody that doesn't know what they're doing, this could kind of be a recipe for disaster, especially with a bunch of uh, unaltered dogs meaning not spayed, not neutered. Especially with uh, two unneutered males around a female that's not spayed also. So you just keep your eye on them, make sure they maintain that, that calm state of mind, they don't fixate, they don't get tense.
And that's how you work through it. So it's, it's no different than a, like a human, if they have a problem with heights, probably the only way you're going to get over it is to be up in high places a lot until you get over it. You're scared of dogs? Spend every day around a bunch of dogs and you'll be over that. So there was Max. That's how we do it. Hope that helped a little bit. I know everybody, almost every dog I get struggles with this, so uh, maybe that'll help you out. You just, first, you just got to go get you about eight, nine dogs to do it. <laughs> so we'll talk to you later. There's Maxie. All right, see you later. Toodles.